Howdy folks, Kiwi here, and welcome to a brand new game. This one is called Tales Across Time. Now, I know very little about this game, uh, but it's like in a sort of 16 kind of bit sort of style, and I don't know, I kind of like that style. I'm not much for adventure games, but I like time travel, so who the fuck is to say what any of this means? So we're just going to jump right in and see what we're doing. Uh, new game. Critical CG Games. Also, sorry about the, the black bars on the side. This is absolutely a square game. <laughs> Alright, there's a plane in the desert. One that clearly doesn't belong. Oh! Oh, hello, people. Um. Also, this game uses arrows and not WSD based on the menu. Woman, hey there. We're just about ready to go. Don't like the look of, the, of those winds, though. I reckon a storm's brewing. Hopefully not. We've got a long way to go yet. And I doubt a simple sandstorm will stop our benefactor. Yeah. The old man... I don't know why I gave her a uh, fucking growly voice, but... The old man's pretty obsessed with those ruins. I've got to hand it to him, though. He's tougher than most aristocrats I've met. Is that Lord Blackwell, or is that somebody talking to Lord... Uh. We're moving out in 30 minutes, everyone. 20 if you can manage it. Chop, chop. <laughs> He's tough, all right. <laughs> you know, I don't think we were properly introduced. The name's Monica. Oh, God. No, not Monica. Not another one. <laughs> and she's got another deep voice. How did this happen? Flynn, pleased to meet you. Huh. Not from around here, are you? Well, we got a few minutes before heading out. Why don't you introduce yourself to the others? I'm not here to make friends. I know. But if you're gonna be protecting us, you should at least know our names. Oh, my Flynn. I suppose you're right. Glad to hear it. Come and see uh, me when you're done, okay? Oh, well. Press enter button to talk and interact. That was the enter button. Alright, who, who is blonde boy here? Oh, uh, hello. Need something. I just thought I'd introduce myself. My name's Flynn. Well, I'm Theodore, but everyone calls me Ted. I don't know why they don't call me Theo. It's real weird. Hey, uh, you've been to the Xanus, Xanthus ruins before, right? What's it like? Oh, I get to choose! I am Flynn! <laughs> it was uh, quite dangerous, but magnificent. Magnificent. The ruins are immense, and they tower above the cliffside. Despite the damage, it's a sight to behold. Wow. I can't wait to see it with my own eyes. Assuming I survive the desert, haha. <laughs> uh, just stay with the group and you'll be fine. I know this area well. If you say so. It all looks the same to me. <laughs> Sounds like a shot. I want to interact with fire. This lack of fire. I don't know what to interact with, other than the people. I'm not... Uh, disclaimer, I don't play these sorts of games, so if I miss shit... That's that's entirely expected. Also, I don't think my Discord is set to... Oh, I can't... I can't pause. We're, we're just going. Let me set my Discord to, to not be on. Go. Slot. Thank you. I can't just switch windows because this game is one of those ones that likes to f freak out when you un full screen. G'day, sir. What's on your mind? I just wanted to introduce myself. I'm Flynn. Leo. Glad to be making your acquaintance. No doubt Monica put you up to this, eh? That girl. Always wants everyone to be one big happy family. She probably shouldn't travel with mercenaries and hired hands, then. Oh, well. A little camaraderie doesn't hurt. Besides, 
Monica's used to people like us. She's traveled with caravans her whole life. Amazing. When I was her age, I hadn't even left the city. Yeah, I gave this guy the right voice. <laughs> anyway, don't let me aim on. I'm sure you got plenty to do, sir. <laughs> I'm so far I'm spot on with these voices. Other than, you know, Monica being fucking Western boy. On well, second thought, it's probably best not to disturb Blackwell. Well what the fuck am I doing then? Am I going down here? Seeing what was seeing what's what? Okay, I guess I've talked to everyone I can talk to. When well, you're ready! I could use a hand with a campsite. Well, I'm ready. Great. Shouldn't take too long. <laughs> Whoop! Into the inventory goes. By the way, I was wondering. You're a trained swordsman, right? Uh, Self-taught, for the most part. But yes, I know how to handle a blade. Could you... I mean... Would you mind teaching me a few moves? I'm but a simple farm girl. Why the sudden interest? I ain't sudden at all. It's dangerous out here. I know I'd take care of myself, but I'm useless in a fight. Yeah, it's the uh, warrior versus survivalist sort of thing. Figured it was time I did something about that. Stop turning around, damn it. We'll begin tonight. If you're still interested after crossing the desert. After crossing the desert. Heh. <laughs> no sweat. Yeah, quite a bit, actually, been, being in the desert and all. Uh, don't worry, I'll be ready. Not good to hear. We'll see. I'm interested, but curious. What the fuck is happening? Just as a general thing? I don't... I have no idea what's going on. I'm just so baffled. We'll begin with some basic exercises. You need to feel comfortable wielding a blade. It's, uh... <laughs> heavier than I expected. You are not holding a blade, Monica! You lying fool! Don't worry, I once thought the same thing. But in time, that sword will become an extension of your body. It'll become a third arm, you evil. Well... If you say so. Here, hit me a few times. Lob off a limb, it's fine. <laughs> if you want to stop, just say the word. No way, I ain't giving up. This is important. Oh shit, what the fuck? Get back! What the heck is that? A monster. Oh, whoa! Turn-based RPG style! This is perfect! I can demonstrate a real battle. Are you sure? Seems kind of dangerous. Don't worry. Most monsters look more threatening than they actually are. Dazing blow. <laughs> a daisy blow. Case in point, we have plenty of time. Heh. <laughs> Show off. He's literally showing you how to fight. Every warrior has two basic elements. Health, HP, and energy. AP. I don't know why it's called AP when it's energy, but we're, we're disregarding that. Times have changed. Health determines your resilience. How many hits you can take, essentially. Allow it to reach zero and you're dead. Don't allow that to happen. Just let it. Health is the most important, precious resource. Make sure that you don't neglect it. Now, we'll talk about energy in a moment. But first, let's look at basic attacks. Yes, yeah, attack. There are three basic sword techniques. Weak, normal, and strong attacks. Why would anyone do weak? As the name implies, a weak attack does less damage and a strong attack does more. So then why not just use strong attacks? Each of these basic attacks will restore some of your energy. However, the stronger the attack, the less of it you restore. Sometimes the best strategy is to use a weaker swing to build up your energy. See, there's a good reason. I'll explain more in a moment, but I believe our monstrous friend is getting impatient. Um, but yeah, I don't have any AP to restore, so I'm just gonna go strong. Strong. Oh, okay, I do have AP to restore. Are you okay? 
Don't worry. I've survived much worse than this. But it is a good time to bring up defending. In this stance, you can reduce the damage of enemy attacks and also restore energy. Allow me to demonstrate. I want to defend this shit. <laughs> defending. Okay, that's enough for now. I've best put this creature out of its misery. Over time, every warrior develops their own special skills. Including, but not limited to, dancing on a sword. I don't know, I had, I had no uh, joke for that. <laughs> These are powerful techniques, far outclassing the basic attack that I showed you. Stay back! This next strike will end the battle. Ah, uh, skill. Let's see. A precision strike which stuns the enemy, critical strike. Ah! Oh, critical strike! Wow. That was amazing. I've met many people who've put me to shame. But I hope that, uh, but I hope that gave you something to aim for. Um, yes, sir. Let's begin your training. Step forward. Grip the hilt firmly. Firmly grasp it! <laughs> Thank you, Spongebob. Now, oh, well, I didn't... You can't just move dialogue boxes. I was reading that. Damn it. Oh, now they cross the desert. Several days passed. You can't just remove dialogue boxes. I need time to joke. Wind's getting worse. Sir, we shouldn't be out here much longer. You, Flynn, yes. How much further is it? There's an underground cave nearby. We can take shelter there. I have no interest in shelter. Lead us to the ruins. Winds be damned. Sir, we won't be able to lead us anyway if we can't see. There's a path through the cave. It's direct, but monsters have been sighted there. Isn't that too dangerous, then? Still better than staying out here. Very well. We'll camp inside of the cave and set out for the ruins at dawn. Alright, there's people outside. I'm closing my window. <laughs> window closed! And now the old guy doing gardening won't look at me weird anymore. <laughs> He's giving me a few glances. Flynn. Wait, what was his voice? Flynn, you said that these caves are connected to the ruins, yes? That's right, sir. It shouldn't take long to walk the distance. You also mentioned monsters, as I recall. Scout ahead, see if there are any are looking about. I'd like to camp, make camp as close to the exit as possible. Come on, sir, let them rest. We're all exhausted. Exhausted. <laughs> I'm paying Flynn to protect us as well as Guy. If he wants his money, then he'll do as I say. Angry man. But... It's alright, Monica. Just get some rest. I'll be back soon. Huh? Use the X button to open the menu. X. Ah, okay. I'll scout ahead then. No point turning back. Oh, that's back. Still blowing a gale out there. Now, if this is anything like RPGs that I know of, I can just chat with whoever the hell I want for as long as I want. Take a look at these, sir. Must be leftovers from a previous expedition. Well, what happened to them? Did they ever make it down? Uh, sorry, sir. Just thinking out loud. What about you? What a day. Now oh, it feels like there's sand everywhere. Just be glad you don't have to explore the cave. You know, you could have stood up to him. We and Ted would have helped you, too. It'll be safer this way. We don't want any unexpected guests through the night. Suppose so. Anyway, careful, Flynn. Oh god, the, the mixing of the accents is already starting. Oh wait! No! No, I did the wrong voice! No! <laughs> this Leo is the the sort of Australian voice. 
Who the fuck was the redhead guy? Damn it. Lord Blank. What? <coughs> okay. Pause to get water. Wow, that took me by surprise. Oh, water. Mm, oh, it's the best. Oh, man. <laughs> voice actors professionally uh, only do one voice at a time, from what I understand. Oh, Black Will's real obsessed with those runes, don't you think? <clears throat> I want to see them, too. It's not like they're going anywhere. Uh, yeah, Leo was the Australian. Ted is the inexperienced, uh, quiet one. Uh, don't tell him I said that. Get the impression that little Black Will isn't very good with jokes. Yeah, so this is this is fucking Ted. What? Wait, who the fuck is Ted then? I think that was. I think one of them. I think one of them was messed up. What are you still doing here? Get a move on, man. Took me years to organize this expedition, all thanks to that coward Cromwell. I intend to make me up for lost time. We're gonna do this in 32 minutes, or less. Okay, what the fuck are we looking at here? Uh, oh, excuse me. Oh, hey, a monster fight. I got like three and a half minutes. That is a Cthulhu tree. Mushroom, not, not a tree. Um, yeah, it says your AP starts at 5, but then, like, why does it go up from there? Uh, he missed. Cool. I'm going to continue attacking. You are sucky. No, nope, I didn't mean to defend. I meant to use a skill. Oh, okay, cool. Good time to defend. Walk an enemy, strike, and then counterattack. I'm gonna use this. Powering up! Yeah, you attack me. But, what I then do is this one. I, I just powered myself up and then 200%ed that guy. Victory! Yeah, I'm amazing and shit. HP will always fully restore after battle. Stat status ailments like poison are also healed. Additionally, you begin each fight with e AP equal to half your max. There you go. So don't worry if you finish a battle with low health or energy. Yeah, I want to use that finishing blow every time. It's awesome and amazing. Oh, fucking cool. There's a flower in my way. Uh, I can't leave the house. There's a dish on the floor. Oh, you weren't even fucking there! You know, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna fucking... I'm gonna weak attack this shit so I can get extra AP. Eight. <clears throat> and you missed me. I'm gonna strong attack you. Boom. Oh, I missed you. And you hit me. Boom. Well, whatever. My AP's back. So I'm gonna use some of that shit. That one. Dazing blow. Ten pounds. Um, yeah, strong attack. Boom. The normal attack. Oh, shit, alright. I thought there was more to that. Kind of wish I knew his health so I could plan myself accordingly, but whatever. Yeah. Well, I've cleared out some of this area. So this game is just a fighting RPG. That's, that's fine, I guess. Oh, there's three? No, it's just really good at moving. I'm a strong you. Twelve down. I'm a strong you again. No, I'm not. I keep doing things that I don't expect to be doing things. I'm a twelve you again. Oh man, we got a twelve all day? Boom. Fourteen that time. So that dude has what looks like, I did 12, 12, and then 14, so that'd be 38. Let's, let's give the mushroom guys around 40 HP. 
I gotta write this down, but I'm not going to. Oh, hey. I'm gonna check over here for monsters and shit. And then go out this door. Or not. There's the exit. The wind is still pretty strong, though. Can I leave? Almost there. Okay, I can leave. But also... <laughs> God damn it, cutscene. Good. You did very well. You did well to parry my... I never knew how to pronounce this word. I've only ever seen it in books. Reposte? Repost? Repost? I don't know. Hey, you still got me, though. Ow. <laughs> oh. You've, you've advanced remarkably quickly over this past week. All things considered, you might be a natural. Yeah, natural getting hit. That's that's what tanks do, so yeah. We uh, still have a lot of work to do. Hang in there, kid. Don't worry. I ain't ever giving up. Ever. Okay, cutscene's over. Can I can I end the episode? Monica, why are you doing this? Huh? I told you, it's dangerous out here. I want to take this. I want to protect myself. There's more to it than that. Please, tell me, what's driving you? Well, my mom owns the minivan. <laughs> you know, I spent my whole life traveling the desert. I need water. It ain't a bad life, but I've seen some terrible things. Terrible. It's just terrible. My last caravan was attacked by bandits. I survived by hiding under a wagon. But most, uh, weren't so lucky. I ain't ever felt so... powerless? Yeah, exactly. And I don't ever want to feel that way again. That still doesn't answer why suddenly, why not earlier. Thank you for telling me, I know it's not easy. So then, what about you? What did you learn to f why did you learn to fight? Uh, surpass me and I'll tell you. You gotta be kidding me! Come on, think of it as more incentive on top of the incentive you already have. Let's get some rest, we'll need our strength for tomorrow. Can I just- nope, can't stop in a cutscene. Not once can that happen. Am I- am I good? God, I couldn't go faster. The wind's dying down. Should be a straight shot to the ruins. I don't expect any trouble. But I'll go on ahead just in case. Follow me when you're ready. Thank God. Alright, that'll be it for this one. What the fuck does that shit mean? Three... Oh, is that like three lives? No. Well, that'll be it for this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Of course, I'm Kiwi. You're great too. And you have yourself a delightful day. Goodbye!